So what SBDC allows is truly unlocking that ability to have a trustless Bitcoin economy built on Bitcoin layers. SBTC enables using Bitcoin on stacks without users taking custody or centralization risk. It opens up new use cases to take Bitcoin, lock up the value, and use it in new applications. It uses a peg in, peg out mechanism. And so basically that allows us to trustlessly bring Bitcoin into the Stacks ecosystem. For example, you'd be able to take your Bitcoin directly from L1 and mint SBDC, which you could then use on Gamma, on Alex, on all of these different platforms. We have wrapped tokens on other chains, but none of them are, are trustless. The majority of them are, are custodial, but SBTC seems to be one of the more trustless versions. I coined the nickname Sugar BTC because yield and benefit would be sweet without being artificial or compromised by risk of centralization. Even things like creators who want to put more value in their communities and their NFT projects, they could use SBTC as a new form of value lock. For example, an artist that launches their collection on Gamma can get paid in Bitcoin that they can instantly use um, on any platform that accepts Bitcoin. Yeah, I always say that it is the most decentralized Bitcoin derivative that we can get our hands on. Hey everyone, my name is Andre. And I'm the product lead for SBTC. Today, I'm excited to release our two-year roadmap. SBTC is a one-to-one -one Bitcoin backed programmable asset that will enable users to put their Bitcoin to work in a secure and decentralized way. This is the missing piece to unlocking Bitcoin in DeFi and decentralized applications. The roadmap is split into three phases. Phase one is about laying a strong foundation. In Q1 and Q2, we will release a testnet and developer release to start getting early feedback from developers. We'll be conducting user research, developing strategic partnerships, and recruiting founders to build in Bitcoin DeFi. Phase two is about delivering a world-class user experience for Bitcoin. This will start in Q3 to Q4, and this is when we will activate SPTC on mainnet along with the Nakamoto release. During this phase, it's crucial that we have security audits, kick off hackathons to support builders, and convert our partnerships that we kicked off in phase one. Phase three is really about our vision of building a thriving Bitcoin economy. And this phase is really focused on network growth and adoption and providing a seamless user experience for Bitcoin. In conclusion, Bitcoin is no longer just a rock. It's the settlement layer for the digital economy. And SBTC will play a key role in unlocking the $450 billion of Bitcoin capital for productive use. If you're interested in building the future of Bitcoin DeFi, please get in touch. We'd love to chat with you.